A hot topic right now is the vaccine debate. And joining me is Carmen Chai, health reporter for globalnews.ca. Hi, Carmen. Hello. So you've been looking into what actually goes into the measles vaccine. And what have you found out? Right. So vaccines are very controversial right now. And what I want to do with my story is to look at what goes into a vaccine and how it's made. Uh, so what I found is that, uh, like the flu shot, the MMR vaccine is made using chick embryos. Scientists use what's called attenuated virus. That basically means that the viruses in the shot can't replicate. So you have to think of it as being just enough virus needed to trigger an immune response. Uh, then there's salt, sugar, vitamins, and gelatin. They're all used as stabilizers to keep the vaccine together. And there's also what's called neomycin, which is basically used to preserve the vaccine. This entire debate is really about one question. Is the vaccine safe? Right, exactly. Time and time again when I do my interviews, the doctors say the same message. Vaccines are safe and they're highly effective. Parents don't have to worry about a link to autism. They don't have to worry about heavy metals in the vaccine. Uh, what they really should do is vaccinate their kids. Uh, a first shot is typically administered at the one-year mark. And then again, when they're about four years old, the first vaccine offers efficacy of about 90%. Uh, the second then boosts your immunity to about 99%. Uh, so no vaccine is perfect, but it gets pretty close. And you break all of this down in your story. Right, exactly. So my story is going to look at what goes into a vaccine, how it's made, and I've also asked doctors to address some common misconceptions that might be out there. Thank you so much. Thank you. And for more on Karma's story, go to globalnews.ca. I'm Alison Bushnick.